kids wanted to get a dog and I suppose being born and reared into greyhounds, greyhounds were obviously always going to be my first choice. Um, they're a fabulous pet and uh, we just started the process and decided we'd get a retired greyhound. So I contacted Joanne and the ARGT and they basically advised me what I was to do regarding just preparing my own place I suppose. The main thing is just to make the garden secure so that you have a bit of comfort in leaving the dog out and that the dog won't be spooked initially when you get there but um, not really like it was it was just secure the garden really and you know make it comfortable. Then we just basically come down to, to Finola and, and collect the dog or see what we had. All adopters will have to fill out an adoption application so this gives us a better idea of what kind of greyhound would suit their home um, and we will also require a home check so at the moment there will be no home checks it's all virtual so we ask adopters to send us in a photo or a video of their home and garden. So once all that is approved, we will put them in touch with the care centre or one of our foster care centres where they can come and meet a few greyhounds that have been selected for them. So each greyhound will have a profile um, and we will do our best to match every greyhound to the right family. So each greyhound has their own personality. So the greyhounds will meet the family, see if they get on well together and um, yeah, see if they're a good match. Again, have always been very, very good for the IRGT. Um, so they have sponsored adoption packs. So each family that adopts a greyhound will receive an adoption pack. So they will contain a voucher, um, a greyhound jacket, an IRGT high vis, um, a snood, and other merchandise for IRGT. That's gone really well. She's settled in really well. Um, you know, I suppose I kind of had an idea of what it was going to be like, um, but I suppose I didn't expect it to be as easy as it was. In fairness, she's settled in really well. The kids love her and, you know, she's a brilliant, brilliant pet. The first week we kind of thought, you know, um, this was very shy, but within, within about two hours she had settled in. And she's the boss of the house now and you know what, she's kind of ruling the roost. We said it all along, grounds, they make brilliant, brilliant pets. And, um, you know, she's just, uh, she's really clean. She's, you know, really good to handle. I suppose, look, she's used to being handled by people, but she's brilliant with the pet, uh, with the kids and uh, it's, it's been fantastic so far. I suppose like with any pet, I suppose, just uh, understanding, you know, I mean, if your facilities that, you know, have them, have like, have everything ready when they come, that's, you know, that the dog won't escape. Now, grounds are very good in general, but I suppose like any dog, they're inquisitive. Um, and you know, just I suppose a bit on diet. Again, you know, greyhounds are very easy to feed, but you know they need anything. But uh, again, a bit of studying on that, and you know, but uh, you know, just be a bit prepared. But other than that, you know, very very easy. She gets two walks a day now, all right. But she loves going out for her walk. But you know, they're they're lazy. They love to relax. They're dogs that they love human interaction, but they also love their own time, downtime. And um, we give her a couple of walks a day, but it's not necessary. If it was a really bad day, she might only get out for 20 minutes. And you know, and she's really lazy and just you know relaxes. Anyone that wants to get a pet, I would strongly advise a greyhound is is your only option. They're clean, they're really, really gentle with people, and they're so so easy to handle. The only thing, all right, you you lose ownership of your coach. They, she loves the coach, and you know you kind of have to ask the dog if you can sit down now. So it's just it's just the one thing. But she loves the coach, and you know she settled in brilliantly.